Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Goes Sweden. Today I'm already on my bed because it's already kind of late and I nearly forgot about today's video. But if you're here to watch my reaction for the song from Lithuania, check out the timestamp. There you can just skip forward because right now I am going to talk about my daily life as always. So what did I do today? Well, we had a new start of a week and actually I am now finally not the newest person in my department anymore. We had a new colleague joining today and well, as of right now, he has to go through the same whole procedure as I had to go through, like all the documentations and trainings. So I don't think he's going to have too much fun in the beginning. But as I am a very open person, I'm already looking forward to have some nice conversations with him. He seems at least like a very nice guy from the first day. So what else happened? Well, I am at least somewhat done with my programming. I think I am done in the case that I have really now finished all the mandatory things that the program has to do. Or the two programs in the end it is actually. But when I included them in this whole test stand thing and I tried to run it, the whole test stand sequence just got stuck in an endless loop. There was no chance of terminating the sequence, aborting, not possible. So the only chance to basically close the whole program was using the task manager. So I have no idea yet what the problem is, why it gets stuck somewhere. Also some buttons that should appear are not appearing. But yeah, that's probably tomorrow. A lot of fixing, but I'm still looking forward to because I know that I have to learn it anyways. Another thing that was coming at work today was another small problem with this stupid machine that I am the master on. And actually, like the, the problem is not really a problem because when you run certain tests with that machine, it always tells you now that you have too high resistance which is kind of weird. Apparently it worked a few years ago, but now it just changed. So, and the, and the most weird thing is actually, there's this high precision mode, which kind of tries to compensate for the internal resistance. And when you turn that on, you don't have the, um, you don't have the fails of, of too big resistance, but when you turn it off, it just tells you, no, it's too big. So my guess is actually that over time, the machine increases its internal resistance. So, of course, I don't really know if that is possible. But my guess is that if cable get old and maybe uh, something gets rusty or whatever, that you also have an increase in resistance. And that's maybe a reason why every program now is struggling to get the yeah the, the original value to measure the thing precisely. But I don't really know. Maybe there should be a calibration. I don't know. But it really, really is a bit frustrating that it is now yeah struggling basically for every program that you're running the machine on. Well, that is just something now that I have to deal with. And it's still fun because... You get used to the problem. So like I already knew when there was that one guy and he told me like, hey, the machine has two big resistances. Then I was like, okay, well, let's try high precision mode. And then it was gone. Yeah, but it's weird. It's really weird. And because this is all of the things that just came up on my mind that have been important for today, it is now time to make a change to the reaction of the song from Lithuania. Hey guys, I'm LJ and today we will be reacting to Sylvester Belt, Luke Telk, the national performance from Lithuania for the Eurovision Song Contest 2024. This is the first time that I'm listening to this song, so it's going to be freshly new, no idea. And as always, first listening to the song, then my opinion and also at some point so that we can rank in the end what are my favorites and what are maybe not so good songs, in my opinion. But now, let's go. Okay, the crowd is already loving it. Okay, 
be changed, but I love it. Okay, now I don't think I'd like it anymore. <laughs> A lot of glitter in this song. Okay, now that part is cool. This is really club music in my opinion. Okay, so what do I think about Sylvester Belt Look Talk? Well, in certain ways I like the song, in other ways I don't like it. Like when the beat drops in the chorus part, the beginning I always like, and then it moves in a direction that I think like, mm, not so much though, anymore. And But it's also not bad, but it's also not good. And that is a difficult decision for me. <laughs> the crowd loves it. At least the uh, one that was here for the yeah, national show. I think it is actually one of those songs that is close to getting to the final. Depends how much the people like love the charisma of the person and also how the song is communicated to the people. Maybe if they hear it before, they can build up a certain you know, feeling, listening to it. So I think like if I would listen to the song right now, it would get better and better and better. But there are a lot of people at Eurovision Song Contest in the audience that have never listened to the song before. They just want to get, yeah, the first reaction as this right here. So I don't think it is the best for a one-time listening, but good when you repeat it. So how much points do I give Sylvester Belt? I think I go with six points. This is my stomach telling me right now six, but I don't know why. I really cannot tell you why, it is just six. But as I said in some of the other reactions already, in the end when I have reacted to everything, I will yeah go through it and maybe I make some adjustments. Okay, so that is my opinion on the song from Lithuania. What do you guys think? Do you think this is a generic Eurovision song or do you think this is just awesome? really catchy because i have listened to it now after the reaction another yeah at least multiple times and i've really liked the catchy beat and the rhythm and it's it's a nice song to dance to when you're cooking so what do you guys think also feel free to include a certain ranking starting from one point to ten points um, and when you're done with that, we will see each other tomorrow when it's time for the next reaction. And tomorrow it is time for the song from Luxembourg. I have actually have watched the national final, if I remember correctly. But only last parts. But more on that tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye bye.